Hi, I'm Dennis. Joining me is Devraj. Really? Hey, I'm Raghav. And today, Dennis is well, the second boss of the DLC book. Okay. So yeah, I mean you jump straight into the action. Well, tell us about it, dude. It's fucked. <laughs> Fucked as in broken? I, yeah. It's fun as fuck and tough. Okay. Yeah. The thing is, right, if you're a shield user, yeah. the first phase kind of gets trivialized. Okay. Because she'll just chip at you. She can't actually break your shield anyways. But she has like a command grab equivalent of Dark Souls in this. Okay. So she'll just go through your shield, fucking slam dunk the shit out of you. Okay. Look out for that move. She's she's a humanoid boss, so once again you can parry her or backstab her. Okay. Which kind of also makes it easy. Oh. The thing where she goes in goes invisible, but you can see there's snow right all around the stage. So if she moves left or right, you can see if she's gone left or right. If oh, okay. there's if the snow just pops up, then she's behind you. She jumped behind you. Oh, okay. Over there during that time you can get a full charge move and wail on her. <laughs> okay. But that's pretty much the first phase yeah. okay yeah. So there's different phases that's what I was yeah so the second phase I would have to say is like one of the easiest fucking shits I've ever oh. played yeah it's second phase it's I mean it looks like you might get tag teamed uh, but no yeah but what happens is the sister Frey just starts spamming spells okay and the father starts running at you like a dumbass <laughs> Okay. And he's super slow and easy to dodge. So what you do is dodge right, get some hits on, back off. Okay. If you're like a cheeser like me, you can use a priest chime and just keep getting your health back. Okay, okay. That's pretty much trivializes it. But the thing is, at some health points, I don't know exactly which. I think it's the halfway health point, where the f- sister, what's her name, fucking freed, freed. yeah. yeah. R- uh, goes in invis but she doesn't come out and slam dunks you she starts healing so you'll have to see where she is oh. and hit her out of it otherwise it's like back to full okay. health fuck you oh, so they have a shared health bar not yeah they have a health shared health bar not like Bornstein yeah. and Smoke where it's like fucking dumb <laughs> yeah okay thing yeah, is but it is dumb if she heals herself man it's like well no dude it's like a long charge time for oh, okay. it you can just have a full charge attack and wail on her again or get a backstab on her if you want okay. uh, once again humanoid body so easy okay. to get backstabs on yeah the only part that's hard right if both of them are near you and you don't have stamina oh, you're yeah, fucked yeah, yeah. there's no way you're getting out of that that's the only thing because what happens is the father chases you sister free stays back and sp- starts spamming her frost attacks oh, okay so it like covers up some state but it's really easy to get out just dodge right okay there's I, nothing else it looks like this might uh, be more favorable to ranged builds and ranged magic users if you think I mean so. if you want to but there's literally no use of wasting mana on this phase so I don't fun. think it is at least okay because the fat guy is not really fat the <laughs> Man with the chair stuck up his asshole, right? It's really easy to dodge and really easy to get hits on. And okay. they both share the health bar, so oh. like fucking trivializes this part of the way. The only part that's hard in this ball is the first phase and the third phase, right? Okay. Because it's a humanoid. And she has bloodborne typish movesets. Okay, okay. If people who've played the older DLC, they'll know of a special character called Lady Maria <laughs> or Mario or however the fuck you pronounce it. I mean, yeah, she also reminds me, okay, this is the healing. Yeah, that, the healing. You just have to look out for it. I got cheesed out, dude. Like, she was standing behind the dude oh. with the fucking chair. While him spamming spells. <laughs> so I had to just hold that shit. So this, the fire, it's like, the fire on the ground is just for show, or? The fire on the ground that is there is just stage. Oh, okay. You don't get it by that. Only what he drops. But if he just turns his fucking Lord Vessel or whatever the fuck it's called, huh. down st- and fucking starts pouring lava out of it, huh. then you get it by it. Okay. It's like a test of how much you can just like be patient. Okay. You'll get hits in. That's free. Okay. The third phase, right? Huh. God, give up. <laughs> <laughs> how many tries did you do it? A lot. <laughs> <laughs> Well, the thing is, I was on New Game Plus and so three hits basically me dead. Okay. So what, she's reborn? What does she like? Yeah, she just... Well... Okay. <laughs> I don't know. 
Uh, when she's on black flame fire. Yeah, I I don't know what this is. She starts reminding me a bit of like the, you know, the guy who was from Dark Souls. That's all. Demon Souls. There was a boss, like Old you know, King Alan. Yeah, who was like crazy. He used to, but of course he used to yeah. teleport at you and all, which was like trickier to handle. Well, again, in this phase, the two things you have to look out for is one of her command grabs is where she slices off your neck. Okay. And that does like. For me, it did ninety percent damage on a oh, higher difficulty oh, stage. Okay. So I had to always stay embedded. Okay. In for those who don't know what embedded is, it's like humanity. Yeah. For those the older fans. <laughs> But yeah, because I didn't have that much health, she would always like command grab and then one shot me after that. Okay. So I had to stay like full health or no. <laughs> But you, I mean, okay, that also goes to the fact that your character is a bit under level for this level Dude, of. It's uh, yeah well. That's the fun part. Okay, so it's like what level one? Forty six. One forty six. Yeah. And this new game seven. seven. Yeah. Okay, so it's pretty under level, man. Yeah, that's the fun. <laughs> <laughs> Now I'm saying, I guess some guys could, if they have a higher health build or something, it might be. Easier no, it still does a lot of damage. Okay. Mm. Oh yeah, this. The is one game. part where you really have to look out for it. Right? She goes invisible. Okay. Instead of doing the command grab straight out of it, she'll start spamming spells. Go invisible again. Do another frost wave. Yeah. The third time, right? She'll take a while to charge up. But if you get hit by it, it's over. Okay. It's like one shot for me at least. Okay. So if you hit her out of it, you'll get like a lot of damage in. Okay. Once again, she's like a humanoid boss, still humanoid, so you can parry her or backstab her. Yeah, but her dashes and all look pretty intimidating. She's well, it's her. a Dark Souls character versus a Bloodborne character, but since it's AI, you can oh, beat okay. it. But yeah, because <laughs> she does that German air spam, which I you know looks like that to me. Okay, this is her invisibility. Yeah, you have to look out for it. And if she sidesteps, you can just see it. Okay. But if she jumps right, you have to look behind you and see where she actually landed because oh. she only. L- becomes visible for a few frames oh, during okay. that entire thing if you lose her then you're okay. fucked Damn. <laughs> run <laughs> so yeah i mean she's got like area of effect and she has good range too because well two sides <laughs> oh my god yeah she does long combos so some of it you can parry i didn't get the parry timing down i just did okay. it once ever <laughs> oh, okay 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 that's the next slash is it yeah Looks hype. <laughs> it does. All it does me. look hype. But yeah, dealing with it seems like. So oh yeah, and the main part you get the hits in at the right time. Like oh. when she's swinging, she doesn't have super armor on. But if you're okay. swinging at a great sword, okay, you'll have super armor on, so you'll trade. You'll okay. do more damage to her basically. I mean, can you like take a step back and use projectiles on her while she's attacking you? Suppose like you know throwing arrows. I mean, sorry, the throwing knives, arrows. It's worthless, dude. Okay. Like just get hits in that do damage. Okay. What about spear users? Same thing. Same thing yeah. Okay. D- you do damage with weapons. That's it. <laughs> okay. You and poke her with the pointy and she dies. <laughs> <laughs> As you did here, and that's it for this walk through. Well, if you guys want any other walk through. Yeah. Then let us know in the comment section below. All right, guys. That's it from us. Um, hope you enjoyed the boss review. and well you can thank dennis for being such a huge dark souls fanboy uh, if you like the vid please like the vid and subscribe to the channel for more content thanks for watching